Falling to pieces in my room Are you coming over? That's cool I could use a little something to do Go outside, take a little ride if you want to That's cool I did what I was supposed to There's nothing left for me to do So now I'm walking out Hello and welcome to another week of Med School Diaries. This week's theme is Be Less Behind because with each passing day, the content piles on up and it never stops. I've had a pretty hectic past few weeks with a bit of personal stuff and a lot of family visiting from over east, which was incredibly fun and fulfilling having the house just be a little bit rowdy than usual. But it also made keeping up with uni work just all the more challenging. No matter, I'll forge ahead and focus on improving my uni life balance just a day at a time. Currently, I'm great with the life side of things, but not so much the uni side, if you catch my drift. I'm determined to make it a great week, so let's get some sleep first. lab today was something <laughs> it's kind of crazy how fast the weeks go by during uni in this degree we have 20 week semesters with a study week in week 12 and notice how it's called study week and not study break because it's a week for you to study not necessarily take a break from studying in my undergrad semesters were 13 weeks long with a break usually around week seven so i'm not used to this course structure yet which explains why i usually burn out around this time of semester but it's okay because this is just a new norm that I have to get used to. I'll either get used to it or be left behind, so we'll see where that goes. <laughs> but for now, I'm gonna have some overpriced spring rolls for lunch and meet up with some friends to do some clinical skills practice.
Hello, Narada New here. So basically at Teddy Bear Hospitals, we head to a primary school and set up three stations. Kids bring in their sick or injured teddies from station to station, which includes a waiting room where they tell us what's wrong, a doctor's station where we take x-rays and listen to the teddy's hearts, and finally a nurse's station where we prescribe fresh fruit and apply toilet paper bandages to help their teddies feel better. Teddy Bear Hospitals are a great way to help kids feel a little less scared when going to the doctor. A, big A stands for area, equals half times the diagonal, so... Uh, Just go by more, right? Yeah. I bought a new pack, but we have... Mm -hmm. Really? That's what I remember it is. Skills was actually pretty fun today. We finished learning how to conduct a GI examination, which is kind of wild because we're actually palpating and really pressing down on the abdomen to feel certain organs. There's this one maneuver where we palpate the kidneys by bouncing them between your front and your back, and another one where we press our fingers right below the rib cage to feel for the gallbladder. Looking back on this week, I started off strong but really began to fall off at the end. My mental health hasn't been the best this year, and I'm trying to go easy on myself whilst also pushing myself to get things done. Which is easier said than done. <laughs> so for now, I'm just trying to put one foot in front of the other. We're moving on to the renal system next week, so hopefully that can be a good start. I talk about you to everybody that I know now they all love you. Cause you are the one who lit a fire. The way I walk the way I talk, you lift me high. How did you flip?